chloromethane. Oh, that's not a good color. Is methane, but it has a chlorine instead of one of the hydrogens. So the IUPAC name for this is chloromethane. Chlorine, you say chloro. Bromine would be bromo, and iodine would be iodo. So we just like we took methane and said that was methyl as a substituent, chlorine becomes chloro. And so we name this as an alkane that's substituted. So this has chlorine on it, so we're going to name that as a substituent, chloromethane. There's no need for a number because there's only one carbon. There's only one place it can be. So the IUPAC name for this is chloromethane. So the common name, you think about it a little different. You think of it as a halide. You think of the chlorine as the base part and what's attached to the chlorine. Well, this is a methyl group, right? So they call this methyl chloride. It's kind of a difference in perspective. Are you putting ketchup on your french fries or are you putting french fries on your ketchup? That's not necessarily a good example. But is the glass half full or half empty? Maybe that's better. Just a different focus. Any questions about that? There weren't really any examples or anything. We'll have to do some of those later. I think that's a good place to stop.